Hey everybody, it's Chainsaw Reacts back once again with another reaction. Today we are checking out Supergirl Season 5 Episode 16 entitled... Alex in Wonderland. Okay, so a, a kind of a Alice in Wonderland tie-in. Yeah. Okay. Now, I think it's obvious because everyone's been talking about it. This is the episode where Alex essentially is going to be seeing herself a Supergirl. Or something. I'm excited. They hinted yeah, at the it. Little, the little suit. Yeah. And picture I showed you that picture that. weeks ago when um, when they were filming that episode. Yeah. I thought at first that it was the actress was just posting a Photoshop image. I originally thought that's what it was. Like, oh, that's really cool Photoshop. You know, like, what if Alex... It's real. It's legit. Um, I thought it was cool. The one thing I did like about last episode was when she was, like, had the, um, like the lenses mm -hmm. in... And it was like going through all these like pictures, all these different all yeah like options of what she could do, um, and, and she's that gonna was pick that one. one. Of her, that was one of them, yeah. So we got to be honest. Supergirl has been dropping the ball horribly these past two episodes. I only posted the last reaction for last week, just to say if it doesn't pick up, we're gonna be dropped. We're not gonna react and post our reaction to the show because it's got to be good. Because yeah. I I spent a lot of time in post production <laughs> making these videos, so. I felt well, like probably I'm hoping, last week was a bunch of us just kind of staring. <laughs> you're just like, yeah, so what saved it was mostly me just staring and responding randomly to shit. That's what saved the video. Um, but no, she was just staring at most of it going, okay, I'm waiting for it to end so I can go to bed. It's okay, dog. It's okay. But still, it was, it was, it, it, if it was a better episode, you wouldn't have been like, okay, when is it going to end? Come on, let's go. I um, felt like it went on forever. Yeah. Was, so hopefully, shit picks up here. And Jeremiah's dead. The dad. Just dead. Oh, yeah. That just, just dead. Like, out of nowhere. Everyone in the was talking about it. In yeah. the last minute. He's yeah. dead. He's dead. They, 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 better, they better have some sort of coverage of that. They I better. Hope. They better. <laughs> like, why bring that in at the last minute and then they never cover it again? So they better cover it. If not, Shame. Shame. You ready for a hopefully good episode of Supergirl? I'm ready if it's good. Let's go. All places for Jeremiah to hide out. Let's go. Open right up to it. Yeah. Did Jeremiah love his daughters? Then why didn't he come back? That's what Eliza said to me this morning. You're in pain. I'm not in pain. Of course you are. Okay, stop telling me how I feel. Okay, then you tell me how you feel. You should be at his burial. The man that I loved hasn't been a father to me. In years. Damn. Hope, help, and compassion. This is gonna get her to get those lenses and go in. As a mother. Aww. Woo! Yeah! Look at that suit. I like the suit. Hey, Kenny. Well, I Have they been in the scene before? And that was a fluke. A lone hacker, Richard Bates, exploited it. For his own ends. Alone? I don't think so. Who's that dude there? Oh, oh, these are different people in the VR, I guess. Bye. He doesn't even know. doesn't even know. He's like, I'm getting out of here. It's cool to say they call her Supergirl. I'm just glad that I can help. It wasn't patched after all. Duh. How come she's not finding this out? Well, if it isn't Supergirl. What's with this girl popping up? Hi. Just, we need to have somebody to explain things, I guess? Very, Absolutely. She's right. To work through. Yes, you do. Have you heard anymore about your sister? My sister. Jill. Sean? We need you with a DEO. Coming now. You're in the DEO. I think she's stuck with the Viathan like that guy. Yeah. Yeah! We've just had word that a short range ballistic missile was stolen from Thompson Marine Base by unknown. Is that you bars? On him? I just saw him on John oh, down him too. Can we try it? 
Who grabs it? Brock! Oh no. Jesus, he's like, ah! Where the fuck did he pull that from? <laughs> what the hell? Hiding it in his pocket or something? <laughs> Jesus! Like a rag doll. Get out of here. Good job today. Good job. It's weird, he's, she's, she's talking to an NPC that's just a computer. She's starting to forget she's in VR. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go celebrate. Celebrate good time. Come on. There's that wizard dude again. She's stuck. She's turned around. Hey, super girl. Super girl. Has a really great costume. Yeah. Now that is cool. This isn't real. What you think all these drinks would be on the house? Um. Are they gonna turn on her? Alex. What is happening? She's gonna get stuck too. The glitch that Richard Bates hacked, it wasn't fixed. She's like, what are you talking about? And I'm fine. He might have been affected. So I must have gotten to her too. What? No. I'll make sure she gets to the Damn it. I don't need to go to the med bay. They're turning on her. Yeah. Mm. Slow down, Kelly. Are you sure? It was like she was lost in there. Yeah. And we need a way. What did they to think was gonna happen? Out. We need to show Alex. Hi, Alex. Hi. How do you know my own name? Because I'm you. You can feel it. Of course, they ain't gonna show him. They didn't bring him back. His life was a result of his choices. Yeah. Not ours. He still should have came to say hey. But it's been Alex, get away from her, please. Hello. Please she has a weapon too. Seriously. <laughs> Tasmaka? Girl behind like a window or oh. something. He knew just what to say to There's make There's nobody life there. Later, how to... Sorry for all the things that I said. It doesn't matter. Why is nobody else there? I have a lot of questions about this. That little thing. Oh. Because the, the, everyone's just clapping. Yay! Um... <laughs> I don't know. What? Well, the whole part where she, like, did the heat vision on the dragon. Yay! I don't know. She did one thing. Um, anyways, I don't know why we started off that way, but we did. <laughs> Supergirl overall this episode. It was okay. Eh, decent. Wasn't terrible. Definitely wasn't like the last two episodes. Jesus Christ. I still wasn't a fan. Not a big fan? I think it was interesting. I liked your suit. Oh, I did. I think it was interesting. I think the most interesting parts of the episode was when she's in virtual reality and we start to slowly start to see where she forgets. Then we think she comes out of it, and then she's in it still, but she's not wearing the wig. I know. Why did she lose that? Oh, because I guess in... I guess to kind of 
make her think she's out of it, and then she has the suit on, like, how Kara would have it under yeah. her clothes, and so we did that move. I don't know. I think it was just a way of trying to confuse the audience for a minute, because we thought that she was out of it, and no, she's she not. No. Um, I thought it was interesting how, like, um, Nia and Brainy and all them were, like, turning on her. Like, tur- they were slowly. keeping her there. And then when Kelly, which I finally figured out her name, shows up, in that little area, and they're like, "No, no, let's take it to the med bay." And they start, and they they quickly turn their expressions once Alex is out of the room. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So like the, the so the the AI or the whatever I forget what they're called the three lines they were just adapting to the surroundings or no it's it's probably that fail safe thing because she was stuck in there. I'm. I mean, good thing her fail safe didn't like like it didn't. I don't know what it was. I don't know. What are you trying words. to say? What are you trying to say? Uh, You're tired. Good thing that Kelly was able to get out. Yes, Could you because imagine if the she old woman, have been the able old to? Wo- and the old woman shows up, knocks Kelly out, or takes her with them because she can't, yeah. you can't just let Kelly go. I thought this was going to happen. I was waiting for that old woman to show up. That crazy old woman. Which, that William thing, he shows up there. That was interesting how there like was a barrier. Of, yeah. And... Like standing face to face, he has no idea. But my thinking is, if he would have walked any closer, would he have hit a wall, or would he have walked right through it? I don't know. Would it have pushed it back further? No, I think he would have walked through it. Or maybe, so. or, or or maybe if it like wall, he can't see. He hits it. He's like, what the fuck? Then he realizes something's up. Well, he found that bracelet. He did. Somebody fucked up there, and he immediately goes to um, Lex Luthor. It's not Lex Luthor. It's fucking Leviathan. Like, I don't think he has any part in this, because Lex just wants to get in with Leviathan, because he doesn't know anything about them, so he's got a way in. He's not involved in this stuff. This is all Leviathan stuff. Um, let's see. So, Kara was barely in the episode, and then they did the whole thing, as I was thinking, they better not just skim over the Jeremiah stuff. So, they didn't, but they really, it was in the beginning, the and then end. in the virtual reality a little bit, and then the end, the last scene. Other than that... I mean, they didn't bring the actor back. They didn't bring back Dean Kane. Now, there were some people online. I'm only going to mention this one time, and it's not about the politics of it. Dean Kane has political opinions that a lot of people online don't agree with, or you know, people, yeah. just, people don't like. So, people were actually happy they killed him off screen because they didn't bring him back because they thought that, oh, the, the writers of Supergirl didn't want to bring him back because of his political beliefs. I don't know what the truth is. I don't really give a fuck. And if that's the case... That's pretty shitty on the writers because this is a show. And yes, there are agendas that people point out on these shows. Regardless of his political views, they should they should have brought him back for a proper send-off. If they were going to... That's just my, that's just my saying. Now, if he didn't want to come back, that's a different story. But um, my, my gripe is at the ending with the funeral scene. There's nobody there. There's no... Because even if there's nobody that we even knew, but they're just, it's full of people there to, that knew him or something. And how awful does it look for his actual yeah. daughter to show up late? And there's no one else there besides, why was uh, Nia and a Brainy there? I have no idea. Probably just so they had two bodies there. Because <laughs> they, they never met him. They don't know him. Maybe they were there to support, to support. Yeah, I, I guess. Yeah, okay, I get that point. But... When you think of a funeral, you would think they would have like more people there. Where was Clark? Where was Superman? Where the f- what the hell is going on here? They could have had a cameo of Clark and Lois because they have a show coming. They could have easily got them in here. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I'm just complaining. I know. Does. Sometimes, <laughs> just being honest, because like they could have. I don't know. As good Helen Slater came back. Original Supergirl from that Supergirl 1984 movie, I think. So they brought Supergirl. Girl on the bar? No, no, no. Helen Slater, the mom. The mom that, oh, yeah, she was the original Supergirl gotcha. in 1984. And they got her to play the mom. That's gotcha. pretty cool. That's a nice tie-in. So they brought her back. But then she shows up in the virtual reality. She has a gun, too. She comes out of nowhere. No, honey, this is real. Here's a gun to fire at you. At that point, they, she would Stupid. realize, ah, oh, yeah, yeah, come on. I like I, the best part is definitely the, the Supergirl suit. And someone pointed out on Twitter, uh, sorry I don't forget I forget your name, but someone said this sucks. This is this is VR, not real, because that suit would be awesome if it, it was would real. Be. It'd be cool. Because my first thought was seeing like, what if 
Alex, something happens to her, and she becomes a, she becomes a, like a Kryptonian too, or something like, or something where she has the powers, kind of like that. So she gets a super suit. That'd be cool, but no. Unfortunate. Oh well. Uh, anything else? I'm trying to think. I think I think it was all just virtual reality. Yeah, and and uh, William asking questions, and then uh, Kelly telling Andre Rojas, "Hey, uh, something going on? Oh, don't worry about it. You know, we're taking care of it." Yeah, not really. And then uh, Andre Rojas being a piece of crap, as usual. I don't like that character. I can't stand her. I can't stand her. Yeah. Well, I think that's it, guys. We're gonna cut it short. Um, don't know what else really to say. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I feel like the show the show has done so much better. I feel like the show needs to pick it up. Because right now we're still dragging our feet. A little bit. But at least we got to see Alex as Supergirl. Something that, you know, people have been saying, Oh, it'd be really cool if Alex had a super suit. And was like, you know, we, we finally got a version of it. It's not real. It's okay. Hope you guys enjoyed the reaction. Hope you guys are having a good day as you're watching this. And uh, we'll talk to you soon.